Hi everyone, Rob here again and uh, today we're going to look at adding images and video content into an ebook in a Pressbooks platform and we'll also take a look at a few advanced formatting things such as adding hyperlinks to text resources that you've already added into a Pressbooks ebook chapter. So I have gone ahead and I have finished adding in my sample chapter text. It's text only at this point. I have saved frequently so I know I haven't lost my work. I like to make sure that all of my text is in and fully formatted before I add any of the media elements to make sure that I don't lose any of this hard work. Now I need to go back to my chapter template from when I drafted the chapter and find my first media that I want to embed. And I'm going to skip this one here and go on to this one because it's simpler, easier to add. It's just an image file of the cover of this particular ebook that we're working inside of. And I have that file saved. You can't copy paste these images directly into Pressbooks. You have to upload them as media files. So I'm going to go back to my Pressbooks chapter. And I have my caption here. So I know I want to put my image right here. To add this in, I simply click on the Add Media button. And I'm going to now need to upload a file. So I can drop my file here anywhere that I want. First things first, make sure you give your file a good file name. You're going to be working on a publication like this with a bunch of different contributors. You want to be able to tell everybody's apart. You don't want to have 30 different people submitting chapters and submitting images called Figure 1. So in this case, I have put my initials on my Figure 1 image and I've labeled it Figure 1 because it's the first one that's going to go in my chapter. And I'll just drag that image over here and I can add my metadata to this now so you want to make sure you add some alt text to your image before you embed it into the chapter this will increase the overall readability of your digital document and make sure that you are fully compliant with accessibility legislation such as AODA in the province of Ontario in Canada so I'm just going to add some alt text to this cover art for the ebook and I can specify some other uh, elements here such as the size of the image the alignment of it in this case I want to leave it left aligned I'm not going to link it to anything and I can choose my size I don't want to go full size that will be way too big I'll leave it at the medium size I will insert this into the chapter and we see that this is now here and I want to make sure my caption comes underneath it so I'm just going to hit the enter key a few times here and my image is now embedded you can also take your caption text and uh, you can reformat reformat it as you like in our case we are simply going to leave it as is and just italicize the figure one to make sure that we're meeting APA captioning standards. I'm going to save after I've embedded this element and if you want to make sure that everything has turned out fine you can hit your preview key and it will show you what this chapter now looks like. So everything looks like it's working out well. I'm going to go back to the next thing that I wanted to embed, which was a sample video. Now, Pressbooks will not allow you to embed a YouTube-based video. You will need to actually upload the video file. For the purposes of students working on this ebook e project as part of our coursework, if you have a video that you need uploaded, you'll have to contact me and uh, share the video file with me or share the link with me where you have your video uploaded onto YouTube and we can handle that for you. So I am going to upload this video now as a media file. And I had that placed right about here. So I'm going to embed this video. Again, I will click on the Add Media button. I will find my video, which I have organized under my media folder. And in this case, I'm going to add the low res ver uh, version of my hi there meet Rob power video 
So I will drag that over. It is now uploaded. And I can add a caption at this point if I like, but in this case, I am just going to insert this into the chapter. So the video is now there. And I'm also, in this case, going to um, add the URL for this video later. So I will just add some text here to view on YouTube. I will go find that video on YouTube by going to my YouTube channel. And here is the link to my video. I will grab that and I can go back into my chapter, highlight this text and to insert a hyperlink, you just click on the link button here, paste in the URL. You can add some link options such as open in a new tab, which I will do. And check to see if I have any other text in my document that needs to be hyperlinked. In this case, I do in my references list. I have one more hyperlink here, which is going to actually be this URL. So again, I need to get my link button. And make sure I select open in a new tab. And that's it. I will just hit save. Preview my document again. I now have my document with an embedded video player, a link to view it on YouTube, an embedded image with a properly formatted APA caption underneath, and another hyperlink inserted in my references list. That's all there is to it.